Hi, this is Dell3524 here, and today we're actually going to be upgrading the RAM on the Dell Latitude D830. So, first you're going to want to flip over this laptop, and we're going to take out the battery. All you got to do is push this little tab up, and then lift the battery up, and then the battery will come out. If anyone was ever wondering, there's actually a SD card reader underneath where the battery goes on these laptops. That is also for the precision line too that looks exactly like these. So for these laptops there's actually two places where the RAM is. This is DIMM slot B. DIMM slot A is on the other side. If you've seen my D630 RAM upgrade you can see the same process there but this one's just slightly different. So all you have to do here is just take this bottom cover off and it should pop right out. Take that off then you have your CMOS battery here, and then here's where the RAM stick is. All you want to do is pull these, both these little sides back to the left and to the right, and it'll pop up. You just want to take it right out. And we're going to be replacing it with this 2 gigabyte Hynix 666-6400S uh, DDR2 memory. Uh, the computer had a... Uh, 2.5 gigabytes in it, so we're going to be putting four. I have two gigabytes on the other other side so I'm going to show you how to do that one too. Alright to install this you want to line up this little part there's a little white tab there same as all my other videos all you got to do is push that in line it up and click that down then we're also going to put back the cover and you can just screw that right back on. So to change the dim slot A on this, you're going to have to flip it back over, open up the lid, and we're going to be looking for this little space right here. You're going to want to take your screwdriver, uh, preferably a flat head. I'm just using a Phillips because it'll do too. And you just want to pop that corner up until one of these come up. Then all you have to do is just lift them up. But your finger will pop right off. Make sure you have the lid flat when you do it, otherwise it locks it. Now that you got that off, there's going to be three screws that you're going to want to remove. One of them being here, another one here, and another one there. So then you're going to go ahead and remove those. Make sure you set those aside and don't let them fall anywhere, they're pretty small. Then you're just going to lift up on this keyboard and it'll kind of pop up and then you pull towards the screen and it'll pull these out from the tabs. And you can just kind of set this on top of the screen. And then here's your other dim slot. You'll just do the same thing as you did on the other side. Just pull both of these tabs, it'll pop out. Pull it out. Align this part right here with the black tab on this one and then you just push down until it clicks in. Take your keyboard, you want to take these little tabs that are down at the bottom, you kind of want to put it in at an angle and they'll kind of just go in on their own most of the time. And then you just kind of push it down, make sure it gets locked into place. Then you just want to just go ahead and screw them all back down. You want to take your top bezel piece, there's going to be some tabs right there you'll just line them up over here they just slide right in then you just want to push all this back down make sure it gets all clipped in careful not to turn on the computer because it will if you didn't take the battery out and then you'll get a message on the screen that will tell you that the memory was changed all you got to do is hit F1 and sorry for not making new videos I've been extremely busy lately um, I do have, I might have some time next week sometime, if you want to see a reflow of the graphics on the Dell Attitude D630, I have to tear the whole thing apart, and then we put it in the oven and reflow it, so if you would like to see that, go ahead and leave a comment you want to, or like the video, but till then, this has been how to upgrade the RAM on the Dell Attitude D830.